Good afternoon. I'm Antoinette June, and this is Free Speech TV's Newswire. Berkeley's Center for Labor Research and Education found that increasing wages to $12 per hour would cost Walmart $3.2 billion if applied to all workers across the United States. The cost amounts to about 1% of the company's annual sales of $300 billion. South Korean women showed their disapproval with nuclear power on Tuesday, gathering outside Seoul's main plaza to protest. Here's more on that story. A group of mothers held an anti-nuclear protest in South Korea today in reaction to Japan's nuclear crisis and the recent shutdown of a South Korean reactor. About 40 women gathered at Seoul City Hall Plaza wearing yellow scarves, white upper garments, and carrying daisies. They said the color yellow represents a warning against the risks of nuclear power. Their white upper garments stand for womanliness. Daisies, they say, represent peace. While Japan's crippled nuclear plant continues to leak radiation, South Korea's oldest reactor has been shut down. A malfunctioning circuit breaker cut off electricity to its key operating systems. Nowadays, we are worried a lot about the threats of radiation from the crippled Japanese nuclear plant. The best way to avoid the threats from radiation is to change the way of energy production. We should put less weight on nuclear plants. South Korea has 21 nuclear reactors in operation at four power plants. They range in age from 33 years to just three months. Twelve more reactors were expected to come on stream in the next decade. 